Good morning, everyone. Happy Tuesday to all. Okay, I have a word of the day I'd like to share with everyone. And today's word of the day is foozle. Foozle is a verb. It can be used with or without an object. It means to bungle, play clumsily, to do something clumsy, awkward, or in or bumbling manner, often when playing, playing golf. I foozled the attempt to move the couch into the apartment and tore the fabric on the arms. Synonyms for foozle are boggle, botch, and bobble. My thought of the day is character is doing the right thing when nobody is looking. So it's easy to do something when you're getting recognition for it or somebody's watching or you're gonna get an award, but when you're doing it and you're just doing it because you know it's the right thing, not because you're getting anything out of it or someone's watching, that is the best part of all. So that will make good character. Okay, I have some I ready shout outs. This is from Miss Stewart and this is from Mr. Branson and Miss Stewart's homerooms for reading I ready minute completion and 100% passage on lessons from the week of March 15th through the 21st. Isabella, Daniela B, Samantha, Abigail, Caden, Joshua, Alejandra, Federico, Clara, Matthew, Vladimir, Stephanie, Valentino, and Dimitri. Congratulations. That is so awesome. Great, great job. Super proud of you. Excellent. Okay. And this is from Miss Carter. This is her 70 to 100% I Ready Club for reading. Lucas Pratt, Ju um, this is for reading from Ms. Carter. Jul uh, Lucas Pratt, Julia Fernandez, Alex Macritelli, Julia Kerkaris, jo Joshua Rosa, and Ivan Palo. And for math, Lucas Pratt, Romeo Rosa, Ivan Palo, Christian Hodgson, Julia Fernandez, Alex Mahatai, Angela Pierres, Fabiana Gill, and Leah Avital. Congratulations. That is so awesome. I love it. Okay, so I have several announcements to talk to you guys about. First of all, so congratulations to all the students. So super proud of you. I have an announcement from Ms. Carter, and this is for all FEA students. So attention, all FEA students. There will be a Zoom meeting with Ms. Carter on Wednesday after school at 2.30. So if you go on your Teams, you will see all the Zoom information. So that is for all the FEA students from Ms. Carter. Go on to your Teams, you'll see the Zoom information that is for Wednesday at 2.30. We are in the last week of the marking period. Teachers, don't forget to put in your, do your grade verification forms. Uh, to make sure you put all appropriate comments that you need to have in there um, and that everything is correct with your gradebook. 
Um, I, I'm, the grade book will be uploaded on Friday, but I am opting, so I'm not going to be in the building, and I know several other people are. So if you have any questions you need to know, let me know uh, before Friday. Uh, but I will be uploading the grades on Friday. Uh, so I can't believe it. At the end of the marking period, that is so insane that we're going to be on spring break. So wow. Um, elementary school, we are still doing the readathon. So make sure that you are doing that. It's a great fundraiser for our school. Um, so all you have to do is read and you can earn money for the school. What better way than that? Than that? And don't forget about destiny and Access 360 and you can get that done. So don't forget about that. Um, so the readathon. Also dress down Thursday. So Thursday is a dress down day from the PTSA and it's an 80s theme. Isn't that awesome? An 80s theme. So that is totally cool. Uh, it's going to be great. So lots of stuff going on this week. Thank you for watching. Oh, oh and it's still Women's History Month. So we were still doing that. Uh, so we still Women's History Month. So we are still celebrating Women's History Month and we're still doing cooperate, cooperation for our values matter for the month of March. Thank you for watching WEXP News. Have fun exploring everyone.